Hello, my name is Dennis Cooper. I'm the mayor of Penhole. And I would like to take this moment to review our year of 2016 and what's happening in the year of 2017. Our community had many firsts. One of the firsts we had was an event around our, our cenotaph. Last year we officially opened our cenotaph and we had our very first remembrance ceremony. It'll be a ceremony remembered by many for a long time. We had a couple other events in our community called the Penn Old Fall Festival as well as Community Christmas. This is our events that bring people together. We have rides, we have entertainment, and we have a chance where families can, can, can play with families as well as neighbors can meet neighbors. This year we formed the Community Advisory Board. This brought together all the volunteer organizations within the community to get volunteers working together so we can build better programming for, for the town of Penhold. Our multiplex has continued to become a destination. We had over 150,000 people this year come and enjoy the event by watching hockey, skating on the ice, using the gymnasium, or using the library. It became truly a meeting place for our community. Council this year reached out to the entire community and they wanted input. So we did that by putting on a couple of barbecues, asking questions and getting results. When we got that results, we fed it back. Uh, to the citizens in October. We found out they had three main uh, areas they wanted us to work on. Enhance the water, in improve the area around the Penhold Regional Multiplex, and build more trails for families to enjoy our community. Our Penhold Fire Department has continued to grow, and with that, they have a cadet program, which partners with the Crossings High School, which is located here in Penhold. The cadet program is unique. There's only three cadet programs in all of Alberta. One in Edmonton, one in Calgary, and one in Penhold. The students received high school credits for being in the cadet program. The fire department also got a brand new ladder truck, a new, a new tanker, and a new tender to improve services within the community. We had a number of construction projects that we worked on this year and now are finished and made our community much better such as uh, improving roads, subdivisions. We had $8 million worth of homes built in our town this year. Over the last two years, we've had 110 homes. That means 253 more people and young families moving into our community. We're building a new water reservoir. We're going to be creating an RV park that's going to be located right by the multiplex and intersection improvements. And we're going to lower the taxes the, for all residents by 5%. We are also working with the, our partners in Red Deer County in the process of annexing the town, uh, annexing parts of, of the Red Deer County and doubling the size of Penhold. Our public works not only takes care of trees and shrubs and cutting grass and moving snow, but they have continued to add more trees. We have over 1,500 trees to make us a very green community and we're planning on adding more in the new year. Be a friend, connect. Come and become one of us. We're on Twitter, we're on Facebook. You can email us, you can phone us. We, we want to hear what you want to say, we want to listen, and we want to try to build as much as possible. Penhold had a great year with leadership and focus. We'll continue to reflect our past and challenge the future. Our pledge in 2017 is we'll continue to listen and watch and respond and bring a brighter, better future to all of us in, in Penhold. This is the place where you should come and raise your family. Thank you from council and staff, and I hope you have a, have a successful, happy 2017.